Funeral services were held today for a Philadelphia dancer whose death is being investigated as a possible hate crime. This was a line outside of the Met Philadelphia in Center City this morning. Authorities say O'Shea Sibley was dancing with friends when another group started taunting him, yelling homophobic slurs at a gas station in Brooklyn last month. That verbal confrontation turned violent, and the 28 year old was stabbed and later died. Police have since arrested a 17 year old. He's been charged with murder. Those who attended today's ceremony said it was important for them to be at the Met today. I'm just here to support my community. You know, I'm also a part of the LGB community, and I know very well what it's like to be involved with homophobia. It's the whole. The whole aspect of homophobia, just the, the fact that it's still occurring and it's still going on, like, it just makes me mad. Like, I, I, it's just like, why can't we just be ourselves without being bothered, without being killed, without being harassed? Like, why can't we just be us? Like, why can't we just be us? What happened to him was definitely a hate crime. It wasn't an alleged hate crime. It was a hate crime. It was evil. It was disgusting. But look at all the love. Got to change, you know. And I asked, as before this service even started, I told the young people in the community that they need to come out and support because it could happen to one of them at any time. It could happen to me. Well, the viewing was followed by a celebration of life ceremony.